Okay, so this is a small little video on how I choose a good baby lotion. And I have four different brands here. I have a Johnson's uh, Bedtime Lotion or Johnson's Lotion. And all Johnson's lotions are consistently the same, I find. It's just got different fragrances and stuff. And uh, this one's called Picara Baby Care. I, I'm, I'm not familiar with this brand. This was actually given to me by a friend, so... I don't know where to get this one. Uh, this was Huggies, a Huggies lotion, and then this one is um, Aveeno Baby. And how I choose the best one for my baby is not only um, the quality of the product, right? So like, for instance, a friend gave me this, but I, I don't think I'd use this because I'm not familiar with it. It's just kind of, it doesn't mean it's not a good product. It's just, it's like, you know, a psychological thing for me, I guess, that if I don't, what are you doing? Are you trying to get the lotions too? <laughs> Are you trying to get the lotions too? So the way that I pick the product for my baby, as you can see, she's almost seven months old. So uh, I pick it based on fragrances. I mean, I, I don't really like to have something that's too strong. This one's actually fragrance free. So at times I might like this one. I also pick it based on the consistency. So like if I take this, this one here, and I'm just gonna put, a little bit on my hand and if I rub it in I'm sorry I'm actually holding my camera oh look oh that was gross sorry okay so if I rub it into my hand so you can see like I, I mean I put a fair a bit on my hand but I actually like the way that this one feels hey hey, hey that's not for eating no ta. no no I'm gonna, I'm gonna actually back you up a little bit I actually like the way that this one feels it's soft it's silky you know so that's how, sorry, my camera's shaking again. I'm rubbing it in. So, and it, and it dissolves into the skin fairly nicely. I mean, I'm also using it on my adult skin. It's different from baby skin, but that's how I pick, you know, my lotions is how, also how it feels on my hands when I'm putting it on my baby. Like, I don't really like, um, I have a very high sensory need when it comes to my hands. Sorry about my ugly nail polish. Ooh. Um, I have a very high sensory need when it comes to my hands. So, I'm very conscious about how it feels on my hands when I'm rubbing it on her body. So, that's how I pick my lotions for the day or for the month or, um, you know, however. So, if I'm not feeling up to smell it, because this one actually has a fairly strong fragrance to it. It smells, you know, very lotion-y. This one doesn't have a smell at all. It, it smells like nothing. So, if I'm not feeling up to smelling anything, I will pick the fragrance free. And of course, you know, Avino Baby, it has a nice consistency. So these are just some um, uh, ones that I would, you know, recommend to you if you're looking for baby lotion. If you're worried about the fragrance or you're worried about, um, you know, you want something a little bit more natural, the Avino Baby is great. I do not have an organic product here, I don't think. No, none of them say organic. But if you're into that, maybe I'll do a little shopping and find one for you. But, you know, so that, like, this is just, you know, I didn't rub it in very good, but I, I like the way that this one feels. And that's how I choose my baby lotion.